Hello everyone, this is Romona coming to you from Social Media How-Tos with Romona. Today I'm coming to you with a video tutorial on how to schedule posts from Facebook to Facebook. So Facebook actually has a scheduling tool uh, built in which a lot of people overlook and don't know that it is there. So what it is, is it is a time saving tool that will help you to schedule your post out. Like you just sit there on one day and you say, I have 10 posts I want to schedule. You go ahead and schedule them and those posts will go out Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, or however you date them. Okay, so before we get started, I just want to remind you that if you are watching this video on YouTube, be sure to go ahead and subscribe to my channel and also click on the notification bell so that you will receive a notification every time I post a video to YouTube and also be sure to like the video. Now, this video also has a blog post that I have written for those of you who like to read the step-by-step -step instructions, and you will find the blog post link in the descrip description of the video, no matter where you are watching it. So if you're watching it on Facebook, you will see a link. If you're watching it on YouTube, you will see a link to the blog post as well. What I would like you to do is first to log into your Facebook page. Once you are logged into your Facebook page, as usual, what you will see is your news feed, okay? And there will be two ways where you can get to your business page. And by the way, this scheduling tool is available on the business page, not on your personal profile. So this is what this video is about. So what you're gonna do is go to the page that you want to schedule the post on. So you can either click on this drop down arrow and select a page, or over on the left, you'll see some shortcuts. And mine is here. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on that page. That's the one I want to go ahead and schedule from. So this will bring me to the Facebook page that I wish to schedule a post on. So, and here's my usual disclaimer whenever I come to Facebook. So you see that I'm um, social media how-tos with Ramona, but you also see that my page name is my old page name. Facebook refuses to allow me to change my Facebook page name. So please disregard what you're seeing and follow what I always instruct people to do. And that is to make sure that your brand matches 100% everywhere that you go. Uh, make sure that your all of your social media handles match as well as your domain name so that your brand is consistent. I am uh, don't have any control over this on Facebook, but my brand is together everywhere else. So that's my disclaimer. Um, so the next thing I'm going to do is we're going to go ahead and we're going to scroll down. And so just scroll down. And when you see uh, where it says write a post, this is where we're going to go ahead and write a post. So go ahead and click in the write a post box. And I'm going to type what I want people to see, right? So what I have is a text to join number. And I want to tell people, um, to get updates, or let me change that. I'm going to say to get info on my upcoming social media classes and social media tips in your inbox text DC social to two two eight two eight so that's my text to join number and that's what I want people to do so 
I'll put a little exclamation point. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and we're going to click on photo because I actually created a photo that goes with this. And I'm going to go ahead and click on upload photos and videos. And then I'm going to go to the actual place where I saved my text to join, which is here. And I will click here, click open. Okay, so what we're going to do is you will, if you look down under your post a little ways, you're going to see a share now button with a drop down arrow. You will also see a share now button that's in blue. What we're going to focus on is the share now button with the drop down arrow. When you click on the drop down arrow, you will see several different options. One will say now, that means you want to schedule it to go out now as soon as you hit share now. The other one says schedule. That's the one that we're going to focus on today. We're going to schedule the post to go out at a certain date and time. Then you see another one that says back date. So if you want to actually schedule a post, but I mean share a post, but actually back date it, it will show up in your timeline under other posts that are um, above that date. So if you, for instance, would schedule this to go out backdated to let's say September 6th and the day is September 9th. It's going to actually go under the September um, 9th post, if that makes sense. Um, I don't know why pe pe some people do it, obviously, because this has been a feature of Facebook for a long time. I've never used it. Um, and then the other option is to save as a draft. So you actually can go in here and uh, type up your posts, add your images or videos and do all of that and then save it as a draft, come back later and then go ahead and share it or schedule it. What we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and click on the schedule button and we're going to pick a later time. So you have to actually schedule these to go out, um, give it 10 minutes so like I couldn't just schedule it for like two minutes for now or something like that. It has to at least be 10 minutes um, out. So I'm going to just select this time for it to go out. And you can actually change the date here if you want. And it says select a date and time in the future when you want your post to publish. Right. And then we're going to go ahead and we're going to click on schedule. And then it's going to bring us to where it says it's scheduled for later. If you hold your cursor over it, you will see that it's scheduled for September 9th at 11 o'clock, 11.03 p.m. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna click schedule post. So now you see it. So what you'll see here is one scheduled post scheduled for today at 11.03 p.m. So if you come back to my page and check it out after you watch this video, feel free to do so. And you can see that the, the post was actually scheduled on September 9th at 11.03 p.m. Uh, but with that, I'm not going to hold you any further because that means that I would have to wait for 10 whole minutes um, to end this video. So I hope this video was helpful. Um, again, this is a, a tool that will help you to manage your social media in the time frame. You know, it gives you time to schedule when you are available to schedule so you're not rushing around trying to uh, send out posts. You can just take like your day off or like a Saturday and just sit down and schedule like get if I want to be, you know, ambitious and post 30 posts, one for each day of the month of September, right? I could sit here and do 30 posts, but have them each go out at a different date and time of the month. So that's what this handy tool is for. I hope that you will use it uh, because it really will save you some time. And again, with that, I want to thank you for hanging in there with me. Again, if you're watching this on YouTube, be sure to like and subscribe. Um, also, the blog post link will be in the uh, description no matter where you are watching it. 
and it will be it will contain the step by step instructions in case you don't want to watch the full video. Okay? With that, I want you to have a great day.